all the viruses have the ability to mutate. And the same has happened with coronavirus. Initially, when the pandemic began in the year February 2020, it was the alpha variant of the coronavirus which was predominant and caused many deaths across China, USA and the European Union. So what is this Delta variant and why we, the doctors and the healthcare workers are so concerned about it? Let's find out in this video. Hi guys, this is Dr. Josephine and in today's video, I'll be talking about one of the most recent mutations in the coronavirus, which is the Delta variant. The coronavirus has gone through all the four mutations, Alpha, Beta, Gamma, Delta, and now Delta Plus. It was the Delta variant of this virus, which caused many deaths across India in the second wave of the disease. It is now present in almost 85 countries across the world according to the recent World Health Organization data. The Delta variant has now mutated into Delta Plus variant which is also known as B161721. So how exactly does this mutation happen? The virus after entering the body makes copies of itself and begins to replicate. While replicating, there is an alteration in the genetic code and thus a new mutant is formed. Most of the times, these mutations go completely unnoticed and are not so dangerous. But sometimes, the mutant evolves and grows into a more dangerous form. The same has happened with the Delta variant of coronavirus, which made copies replicated and is now formed into Delta Plus variant. The government has alerted three states in India, which are Maharashtra, Madhya Pradesh and Kerala, in which many cases of this Delta Plus variant has been reported. Research says that the Delta variant is 35.6% more infectious than the Alpha variant as its ability to bind to the immune receptor is much better than the other variants. The Indian Institute of Serum Research and Technology have found that the two vaccines which are produced in India, Covishield and Covaxin, have found to be effective against this new mutant strain. The healthcare workers are now worried that this mutant strain may be a leading cause for the third wave of the ongoing pandemic. And now comes the most important question. What can you do to protect yourself? As I've mentioned before, that both the vaccines which are produced in India, Covishield and Covaxin, have found to be effective against this mutant strain. So please take both doses of the vaccines if you haven't already. Maintain a social distance whenever you go out. Wear a mask or wear a double mask and gloves whenever you have to go to any crowded places. Use hand sanitizer often. Wash your hands for a minimum of 20 seconds with clean water and soap whenever you go out and come back home. Make sure that you safeguard children and the elderly citizens of your family and help them in wearing a mask and using hand sanitizer. Remember that all of us have to work efficiently in putting this pandemic to an end. Not all of us can do great things, but we all can do small things in great ways. If you found this video helpful, please share it with your family and friends and your loved ones as well. Do let me know in the comment section below which other videos you would like me to do next. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe.